Mr. Brower, what made you want to play Frank Pembleton? Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh, that was harsh, man. That was some harsh shit. <laughs> Wow. Thanks. <laughs> um, I, I didn't know who I, I didn't know who the players were. Um, I didn't know their reputations, you know. And uh, Lou DiGiamo had a little office over on the west side where he was putting people on tape. And so you had excerpts from the script. And so I went over and I read, and then I think which I thought was terrible, so terrible that I threw the sides in the garbage can. I was like, well, that's not my job. And then the next day, I get a call, Tom and, was it, was it Tom and, ugh. David. I can't remember, Tom, I went in and I read with those guys. Right. And, um, you know, part of it is I just couldn't believe that they were gonna give, I mean, this is just the way I was thinking. It's just, I said, are they gonna give a black man this role? Mm -hmm. And I said, I really got to play this. I got to play the, the hell out of it. If they are, if they are going to do this, you know what I mean? I really have to play the hell out of it. Because for so many years, it was like third sidekick from the left, you sure. know? And, <laughs> and I just said to myself, I, I'm just going to, I'm going to eat the Venetian blinds. I'm going to just, <laughs> I'm going to tear the whole thing to shreds, you know what I mean? And so, so that's what I, that's, that's what I remember mostly about that time. So can I just say one thing? No Frank Pendleton, no Barack Obama. Oh. <laughs> wow. Paved the way. He paved the way. Huh? You hear that every day. You hear that. Uh, <laughs>